I decided to, to team up with Herdwatch because I suppose like me, when I'm on the farm, I, I understand that other farmers, they enjoy working with the animals and the machines a lot more than they enjoy doing paperwork. And the Herdwatch app has just made life a lot simpler. You know, all of these little things that I think the farmer maybe would have to do in the evening, um, he can now do on his phone on the farm and it made sure it's done straight away. So like over 10,000 other farmers in Ireland and the UK, I've decided to join up with Herdwatch. I joined up to Herdwatch about five years ago. I heard it on the radio one morning and I just went on from there and I just kind of clicked in there and used to use it on, for animal movements or your, your remedies and things like that. It works very well, same way to register your calves. It's, it's so easy just ABC it like, you know what I mean? You don't feel intimidated working it either because like, it's just nice and easy to run. It's friendly, it's user friendly. For scan dates now, it's very good with ICBF. It's linked in well with ICBF, so it gives us great help that way. And uh, then we'd say we we're animal remedies for board B and all that. It, it, everything is recorded perfectly for them, so they can have no really qualms about it. It's easy enough used. It's very simple watch. Go along and watch it because you can, it'll prompt you along the whole time. If you make a mistake, it's easy to go back. You know what I mean? That's, yeah, if it's not written in stone, you can easily change it back if you make a mistake. Every year we'll try and improve on something. Do you know what I mean? Just to make life that little bit easier. And automation seems to be the way to go. And technology. Uh, I would have seen Herdwatch at shows. So for example, like the ploughing. And so Herdwatch would be the main app it's used I would, every day in the farm, it's several times a day. For everything from tagging a calf, or registering a calf, uh, ordering tags, put, doing your grass walks. Uh, I use them an awful lot for weighing my calves from when they're born, up and see, do they reach target weights. Uh, even just the, even being able to put animals into groups. So you have your batches of animals, it's very easy. and for batch dose and all your remedies are recorded, everything you have in your medicine cabinets. It's just so much easier to keep track of it now. I've been using Herdwatch for the last number of years and I find it great for putting in AI, putting in remedies uh, so that it's synced with my father's phone as well and with the iPad in the house as well so that anyone can access the information uh, without having to make phone calls and me checking up, it's all accessible there straight away. What I use is the a feature which tells me cows that haven't come in heat since they've calved. So I look at that, so once they're gone more than 42 days, I will look at intervention where I scan those cows to see why they haven't come bulling at that point. And uh, also when a cow does come into heat, and I go into that feature, it's easier just to record the, the serve date off of that rather than having to trawl down through all the herd. I find the watchboard feature very handy because it's pinpointing to me what animals are likely to be repeating. Uh, in the system and as well as that it also is pinpointing the animals that are um, closest to calves so that I can pen them separately while they're inside in the shed. So when you're strolling around the field and you see a cow's after losing a tag you can put it into Herdwatch that she's lost it or if you see it on the feed passage during the winter as well you can just put it into Herdwatch so that you can actually order a batch of tags uh, rather than having to be putting them all through so you're doing it as you're moving. Since I started using Herdwatch, the Blue Book has been uh, made redundant inside in the filing cabinet. I heard about the instance competition from my son uh, because we are Herdwatch users ourselves here, so he was just looking up something in Herdwatch. So Patrick, uh, my son, said we'd enter it. The mead box, as we call it here, was uh, invented because of a farm accident. Um, and we need to carry feed from the mead bin to the trough. I designed it after the accident because I knew I wouldn't be able to carry buckets of meal anymore. It's gravity flow, so it does a slope and floor in the box and the box will take 100 kgs of meal and there's a guillotine door that you just open and close and that can be set for different speeds to let the meal out. So Herdwatch is really all about simplifying processes, moving people from pen and paper to the digital world in the easiest possible way. So it's about making paperwork redundant and making better decisions on farm. Um, I suppose I always say people get herd watch for the compliance, so your board BI audits, your cross compliance, taking the hassle away from those because it's so easy to record information on the go, but then they stay because of all the management features that have opened in there, breeding, weight recording, etc, etc. We're constantly building on that you know, as a platform. When the compliance audit comes, you don't have to scramble for paperwork for two days before that, you know. You just literally push a couple of buttons, give your reports to your auditor, 
everybody's happy. <laughs> Paints after.